What's up guys, it's Lorenzo from QMV Fast Tech. What we're gonna show you today is an alternative to the C3 CAV Kenwood 3.5 millimeter to RCA audio video input cable. The newer Kenwood and Pioneer receivers have eliminated the actual RCA inputs and they've all gone to these 3.5 millimeter auxiliary inputs. Now some are capable of AV and some are only capable of audio. You'll need to check with the instruction manual of your radio to find out which one you have. Kenwood conveniently marks it as AV in, so we know this supports video. On some Pioneer radios, you need to go into the settings and enable the AV in. On the Kenwoods, it's generally already set up, so we'll simply select it. We'll test the RCAs using an external video source. In our case, since we are on a test bench, we already have a DVD player set up. So since this is the original Kenwood cable, you'll see that all of our color pairs match up. So we have video, these two will be the audio. Now we'll use a generic cable, which is available from us and many other sources, and we'll show you how to test it. Depending upon which cable you purchase, you may need to use barrel connectors to create a female, or you can just purchase it as a female. And here's our RCA from our DVD player, so we'll just test it. And you can see now we don't have video. The way we test this is by plugging it into one of the two other RCAs and see which one supplies video. We still have no signal and now we have signal on the red. That means that these two are now audio. The way we test for that is we turn up the volume and we plug in the left side first and listen for audio to come out of the left side of the speakers. Now, if for some reason you're not getting any video, it may be because you don't have your parking brake connected. And in this case, we just grounded our parking brake And now we have video.